on the website. It's clear. I mean, there's no interpretation. We will propose to the company a cost neutral no, seniority. No, it's, it's absolutely unclear. Show me the page. Well, I have right to. Here. No, I have Here's to take the a look at it. I have to take a look. Well, it's it's on the tape deal. Oh, no, 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 just, which anyway. one? The, you're the it's, ones you put on? No, no, the one that it's on the internet there, and their web, the USAPA website. Oh, USAPA website. It makes no website. sense to, okay. to want a cost neutral. Why would we want to live under Why would you even bring it up in those words? Cost neutral. We never said it. He did it. <laughs> no, you find it. The USAPA would come in and say, we have a cost neutral fix that's going to buy you labor peace, at least from the two thirds group, which you've recently accused, you've alleged had a wildcat sick out. You know, apparently you've been concerned about that. If you want some labor peace, here's a cost-neutral way to, to get greater labor peace. I'm Mike Bennett at 737FO. I got a question for you. JD what's asked the, you a question the, that website? you didn't answer. You said, he asked you about Plan B. Okay. If you go to Parker, and Parker says, I already paid $300,000 to each MEC. I've accepted the seniority list. You need leverage to negotiate. How are you going to, so basically what you're saying, I, and he brought up cost neutral. Are you saying you're going to sell your seniority to offer a substandard concession agreement to get data higher? Sounds like this would be your only leverage. You have to have leverage when you go to the table. You're offering Parker a cost neutral contract to accept data higher because if I was Parker, I'd say, I already got a seniority list. What's we your just leverage? told you we're not. First of all, I don't believe no, you. Well, that's your right. But the fact that I don't think anybody in this room believes you. Well, that's no, really no, not no, germane no, to the no, fact that no, no negotiating no, strategy no, has no, actually no, been no, built no, for the next no, contract no, because we haven't no, talked no, to the pilots yet. Well, how are you going to get data higher then? <laughs> What's your leverage? You. you don't need leverage. That's been explained. You don't need what? leverage you don't need to leverage negotiate. negotiate? No, to get you said data this is a part of a contract. It's a negotiation. When you have 1,800 pilots that are not standing behind you, you have this portion of your own pilots that aren't standing behind you, what's your leverage? The, the leverage I would suggest to you is that the, the company wants... You stop. Wants well, we never get much. The company wants to reach a single contract because there are a lot of administrative costs. They want they want to merge operations to some extent. And until until they negotiate, until they negotiate a single contract, they have to maintain separate operations. In order to get a single contract, it, this, the seniority is going to have to be adjusted. So you think that, that's that enough USA, leverage? That's the only leverage that Alpha has. I disagree with you. What if you had 5,000 pilots when we were walking the picket line, we had leverage. You have zero leverage, done. and you're promising your guys something you can't deliver. That's all I have. Thank you. Saying no contract is going to go through with Nicolau in place, and we have the West Group saying, Nicolau, that was what we. In, in your parlance, that's what we agreed to, and it has to go through. And, 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 well, I mean that—that's another issue. The U.S. Airways pilots, U.S. Airways pilots, no, no one in Alpha ever agreed to the Alpha Constitution, other than the people who originally formed the union. You only but, belonged to a union for 20 years and did nothing about it until it didn't suit your needs. I don't know how well publicized right. the stripping of, of seniority out in '91 was. Was disseminated. And I think that years came as a, it. a rude surprise to a lot of people. But but the the fact of the matter is, legally legally speaking, we're in a stalemate because both the East Group and the West Group have the ability to veto any kind of agreement. Uh, I, I don't think anyone can dispute the fact that because of this separate ratification process, we're in stalemate. If USAPA gets in, there's going to be a single vote. And data in terms of seniority issue, there's a data, there's a duty of fair representation that USAPA will respect. And so again, my question hasn't been answered. Things, that's how things will move forward. That's how how wages will go up. That's how duty rates will be improved. That's how terms and conditions of employment will be negotiated. Because right now they're not being negotiated. There's a permanent stalemate. And it's because, it's because, you didn't come because of the structure. So you mean you're gonna you're gonna get the Can we can we keep it to the
the questions here? Uh, I'd sure. be happy. So, that one's moderating. Hard. You want me to take that yeah. question? So basically, term? sir, you're basically going to get me higher wages by negotiating? That's the way it's done. That's unless that. we got to Isn't that what we're doing now? No. no. Oh, we're there. not. There's no JNC. Who walked away? Actually, the West did. The West did. Oh, no. 